And that's why UFN is going to be so sick tonight. So make sure all of you guys are tuning in. Make sure you're following the channel so you don't miss a second. And also follow, uh, follow Panda X Gaming on Twitter. That way you can kind of stay up to date for when exactly when everything's going to be kicking off. Speaking of kicking off, we got our next match here. Got a bit of Zeku action, and he's going to be taking on Laura. So there's a, a bit of a shift here, right? There's the polarity that comes with Zeku. There's the guys that are playing that zoning uh, kind of style with old, and the rush doesn't down work. that comes with new. <laughs> I mean, both sides of it, there's, there's definitely merits to each side. It's tough, though, right? Like, you go to the new, you sacrifice a lot, because if you get knocked down, you're done. There's not yep. a lot you can do on wake up. Old, at least you get EXDP. But, oh, man. Yep, there it is. And it worked out. That, that was a really big bet right there. That was the round, actually. Had he not, had that not gone through, he would have gotten stunned, and that would have been it. So the paying off now has that V-Trigger still active if he so chooses it. Wow, nope. Just throws her, and that's it. Yeah, man. Get that young blood going. Oh, back to old. <laughs> <laughs> so now, I mean, this is, because that black mark that comes out, that black scythe is also a projectile, you'll see it negate others. So it's kind of a two-sided coin, right? You have the, the hitbox that kind of comes out. If there's nothing there for that one frame, then the projectile then comes out. So now you kind of get to see these interesting moments where it's like, okay, now we're back to Young. Now he's trying to fight himself out of the corner. But all this pressure and no responses available, not even built into the character. I mean, what are ways that you find that, that people are trying to fight their way out of the corner like this, John? Well, in situations like this, uh, whatever he was trying didn't work. V reversal. Yeah, that holding block. I will say against Lara, V reversal is one of those options where it's like you have to really believe it's gonna work. Yeah. Because sometimes if you if they just block it one time, you're literally in the same situation that you just V reversal for. And so situations like that, that's where I get, th that's where the corner is such a hard place to be at. Not even for Zeku, but for every character. Yeah. Just because you have to consider, all right, are they gonna throw me a, a million times? Am I gonna just get meaty to death? When can I push a butt in? Uh, similar to the conversation we were just having of you have to know your turn, but in the corner it's almost as if it's so unclear what your turn is. Yeah. That's where it gets difficult. And man, speaking of turns, uh, Reels didn't even have a turn that game. I yeah. was talking about it the whole time and he was just getting beat. Nice one is one of those guys. Um, I, I think Doc played him earlier. And he, I think he came for a little while, he was neck and neck with Doc. They had a couple rounds where they were really close. But when the moments were that Nice One broke away was when he seamlessly transitioned between old and new. And it wasn't through V-Trigger. It was those moments where he figured, okay, I've transitioned, I've figured out how to get that life lead, and now I have the offensive advantage. But when he was in those defensive situations, Nice One struggled. And unless he was in old form, it was kind of tough for him to make his way out of the corner. So I definitely oh. understand. And Reels right now is just taking all of the throw baits. Every single one has worked so far for Nice One. But Ooh. Nice and Tire, and once again, we're back into that situation we were just talking. Okay, v that's reversal. where the V-reversal, that's where it can really pay off. Oh. Obviously, it just needs to land. You got to live now. This is a hard one. Oh, you're still in hit stun, homie. That you grabs don't work there. I guess he really just didn't believe his opponent was going to get hit there because he could have taken it. But even then, wouldn't he have been in blocks so long enough to where it would have whiffed anyway? I think the timing was too early. Yeah, maybe. I'm just going to say that was an input error, and we'll move on from there. But nice one. It's looking pretty good right now. It's, everything's going into his favor, except that one time he got stuck into the corner, and outside of that, he's been looking really sharp. Yeah, he looks very sharp when it comes to mid-screen, for sure. Mm. That throw looks so rad. It's just so quick. <laughs> it's really quick. The damage happens before they even hit the ground. It's just so fast. And nice, oh! nice conversion there. Super nice low to the ground. That's safe. That's safe, too. He tried to meet you with that. And now this is a this is a rough situation. You basically don't win from here. <laughs> I mean, Lara can make it happen when she's close to you, but getting in one yeah. and then getting the hit two was that. I think that was that was a little bit too much. Yeah. Had, had he been a little bit closer, I would have said that it could happen. But the fact, the fact of the matter was, he was full screen away, and he had the whole screen to walk. Yeah. It's a losing battle at that point. Excellent anti-air. Nice one. Saying, this is mine. I claim this. This is my manifest destiny. All of this. 
And he's going to continue to push forward as he takes over the rest of this uh, screen. Oh, I see what you did there. You said it was his manifest destiny, so he's going to push forward. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and I, I was wondering the direction you were going with that, but I guess he's not guessing the direction he's going with this because he's moving forward, even though being close to stun now. Fighting back is now nice one. Ooh, forced out the EX reversal there. That's not even a real reversal. It just has one hit of armor. That bolt or the thunderclap. Shoot, what is it? Bolt charge or thundercloud? I don't remember. Yeah. Anyways, I'll figure it out. It's just money. Like, nice one needs to figure out what happened at the end of that round. Yeah. It, it felt like he had a great start. He was pressing He was pressing the initiative. It just kind of fell apart as soon as you saw Rels get in there. But as, as could be the case, like, ugh. Okay. I, I don't look at Zeku, though, and I don't think big damage, though. I think whittle away at your opponent. Yep. Chip. It's, it's similar to Bison's playstyle of when is my turn, kind of. I would say Bison might have the upper edge on it, and that was a very nice answer. Yeah, they're starting to see some adaption in here from Rels. Okay, here it comes. Big money. Cross up. No, not going to catch it. Nice one with the walk back. Willing to put himself in the corner as long as it meant he didn't take damage. Looking to make sure he does not get mixed up. Ooh. This is scary. Putting every button he can out there. He Okay, now the first time we're seeing him use V-Trigger. Wow. He said it's my turn, and it will stay my turn. <laughs> uh. Yeah, that's it. And that's the first time he's used V-Trigger. Yep, that because is correct. Because he has he's had been, he has been forced so many times to use V-Reversal that he's never been able to save the bar. So what is something, what is something, what do you think is something that needs to happen here? Because it just seems like he can't get his offense going, and when he does get it going, it's really not threatening. And that's not Laura. Laura is the character, once she gets going, you are constantly in fear. Yeah, and it's not the kid, for sure. And I don't think Nice One has had that, that fear struck an end to him yet. And that's that's actually the, the root of the problem. In order to play characters like, in my opinion, like Laura, characters like Makoto, characters like Dudley, um, you force your opponent into having fear by dealing massive amounts of damage and making them respect you. And as soon as you've implemented fear in your opponent, that's when you have the freedom to implement your mix-ups and you implement your creativity into it. But if there was never any damage to begin with, because it was stifled at the beginning by the zoning, you're kind of never really able to get in your game plan. So I feel like it was kind of at the very beginning, this matchup is going to look like it's going to go to Zeku, and it looks like it'll finish with that way as well. And there it is, closing out with the critical art. Nice one. Using that feature just to have a second to buffer it a little bit more. 